What is going on everyone and welcome back to your weekly roundup of eFootball 2023 news. So yeah, we'll keep this short and sweet because there is a couple of new things in there to go over. There's new cards, there's new content, there's a couple of new campaigns underway as we're seeing right here right now, actually in game. So the first thing is there is a special login campaign for the next two weeks and you will be able to get 200 coins with that. So this week the new campaign kicks off today which is called a level up campaign. You get 100 eFootball coins by logging in seven days in a row, starting from now until next Thursday. And then it will repeat again next Thursday. So you will get 100 this week, 100 next week if you log in for the next 14 days in a row. Just log in. You don't have to play any matches or whatever. And you also get 38,000 experience points for trainers uh, this week and next week. And then on top of that, we also have a challenge event and a tour event, which are given three times the experience points that you would get for your players after the matches. Uh, they, they're not trainers. They're actual experience points that you can get. So if you've got the right manager, you can get a massive boost on a player's um you know uh, trainer points or his experience points and then also when you complete the challenge event or the tour event you're going to be getting trainer points trainer uh, upgrades here so trainer rewards 2000 for that on online one with the dream team and uh 2000 with the tour event which is usually using the authentic team on top of that then as well you've got three times the experience points for eFootball league as well so pretty decent to be honest if you are looking to train up your squad and when we go over to the actual official website we get a little bit more confirmation on that so from the 22nd to the 29th which is this week to next thursday and then next thursday to the following thursday which is the 29th to the 6th of october we're going to be getting 100 eFootball coins along with 38,000 by logging into the game seven times during each campaign period. So you get 200 coins and you get 38 by two there, which is what, 76? Yeah, some mathematician Stephen Hawking. Here we go. So you get two of them there. You get 100 for logging in every day this week and 100 for logging in every day that week, right? On top of that then as well, these are the events with the special recurrent rewards. So it says here that you get the tour events and the challenge events. You get the experience there, as I just explained. And then triple the experience points for pretty much everything including the eFootball League as well and they just have a little note here on mem remember to train up your players not just the, their overalls but their progression points in the stats they also talk here just a little bit more confirmation about the actual challenge events themselves so it says during this campaign you can gain triple the match experience points so match experience points are different to the trainer experience points the trainer experience points are actual trainers that you get like 2000 trainer points that you pump into your team manually these go on after the game they're like experience points per player after you play with the with them in a match on top of that complete and challenge three for the second time so you can kind of rinse and repeat this as much as you want and every time you get a thousand points which is probably one win on superstar or top player level difficulty i would say uh you get 2000 trainer points here so it's pretty decent i mean you could play five you could play 10 you could play 20 matches simmed over the next two weeks and you could have thousands and thousands and thousands of trainer points if you are looking to train up your squad so going back to the game itself then we do have all we also do have just a quick look at the authentic events and the authentic campaigns that are on it's rinse and repeat with the liga um mx which to be honest with you lads i actually had fun playing with the league mx it's less sweaty it's less try hard and obviously the players aren't superstars and you also get the national teams with an ultimate prize of twenty thousand gp there and you get twenty thousand gp there for clearing the the, the what you call it the event so all you have to do in this one is pick one of these teams and then score goals. That's all you have to do, man. It's very, very easy. Um, and it's the same in the Liga BBVA MX. And then for the actual Dream Team um, events or campaigns, we're going to go into them now. We have here, we have, I think it's one new one and then the rest are kind of the same and then they're kind of carried over from the last one. So we do have, as usual, the Starter Cup, the national team, uh, which we already have completed from last week but we do have worldwide clubs which has got the three experience uh, multipl multiplier boost and we have the european championship which is against the ai so this one against the ai gives you a free chance deal i will be doing a quick video on that as a reminder this is every week now that they're giving you a free chance deal just for completing that one so basically you just play this and then all you have to do is um complete it you can sim the games or you can play the games yourself 
once you get 3,000 points in game you get your European chance deal which is a free spin at the player of the week and this week the players are good check out my review if you haven't already and it's free if you do this and then for the worldwide clubs you get 50 coins for completing that one so yeah I mean it's not bad I mean it, it look it always could be better you know it's all it always could be better um it will be interesting to see the match pass when that does come or what they're going to do with that but it, you know you're getting your three time experience points with that as well so yeah let me know what you guys think of that the eFootball league as well unfortunately for me lads I mean I just genuinely just don't have time to play more than like three four games a day um it's just impossible for me at the moment with doing videos and stuff but we are relegated we were in division three um and this is phase two of it so we will be able to get our you once you sign in you will be back down uh to whatever division they decide to put you at so i was at division three i think and then obviously i've gone back down now to division six um and i do get my rewards which are in the inbox that you can check there and then obviously you have to start all over again in division six so that is going to be open till the 20th of the 10 um uh 20th of the 10th which is 20th of october so yeah just under a month that we're going to have this phase again so i'm going to really have to smack the games if i do want to try to get back to division one but let's see what happens because i do probably will use a new squad um so that will be reset with today's update and then on top of that then as well we do have the new cards which i have already covered in the reviews that i've already done of the player of the week and of the epic players so we have two new batches of players to get through we have the Bayern Munich epic players here and we have the European club championship players here and obviously you can get all of these players if you do that free challenge which I'll have a video out on later uh, you will be able to get one of a free spin on this so that is it lads for me for the weekly roundup um, let me know if I missed anything I don't think I did obviously Juventus um, agent that will go Monday and then the player transfers and the Liga MX and the J League are all gone in the next 13 days which is two weeks from now so that is when I reckon you know the big big update will come content wise in terms of like the probably add a lot more um special players and stuff like that because at the moment in the in the in the premium stuff the premium objectives you have trent there obviously um but we do know that bruno is coming as well bruno fernandez from uh, manchester united he will be coming and then we also have ac milan and inter milan that are still there but club america and we have the manager packs they will be ending in 38 days so that's going to carry on until the next update you would imagine that will carry on what into november um based on that time scale there so they'll probably add a bit more there as well so that is it for me lads short and sweet hope you guys are having a great day um let me know what you guys think and of course don't forget to log in um as well to get that free coin uh bonus for the special login and to get all your rewards by going into the eFootball league divisions if you are smashing the divisions you will get all your stuff there so that is it for me lads i'll be back quite soon with another video it's just your weekly roundup of news on the thursday i will talk to you in a bit peace